This has 63 colors, and let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight Aurora Borealis colors. Won't that be fun? <music> Hi Divas, I have another Dreamer design for you. Perfect for spring. It's called Spring is Here by Alyssa Carey. It is a 60 by 60 centimeter. And it is a, let's see, it doesn't say square or round on the top. So it is a Dreamer design and it's a, but it is a perfect canvas for this time of year, for springtime. I love Dreamer Design saturated colors, and when it comes to doing flowers, they cannot be beat, I'm telling you. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's open her up and find out what's inside. Okay. First, you've got this gorgeous bag. Nice canvas bag to keep them in. And this is kept in a plastic bag itself. Some of them aren't anymore, which is interesting. This must be one of the older kits, which is fine. It's still perfect for springtime. We have this beautiful suede-like bag, flannelly suede bag, tied with the purple ribbon. Okay, let me open this up for you. Let's see. Ooh. You have a gorgeous tray of goodies. This is interesting. This is a purple tray with um, kind of clear, not like some of the other ones that I've seen that are the more solid color. Um, bring you in a little bit. You can see the difference here. And it still has, it has the little uh, pull-up gate on the end. Use, this is a square kit. They do have pointy tweezers, but they're kind of like reinforced points. Um, they're a little bit thicker than some of the other points, um, which is wonderful, I think. Uh, the, the gate is a little tough to get out uh, at the beginning, but it'll slide in and out very easily as you come along. It is to release the extra diamonds. This is a nice, beautiful, big tray. They give you a uh, something to brush the diamonds down to the bottom with or to help them get unstuck if they sort of get stuck to the ends, which doesn't happen often, but it happens. They give you two, where are you? Two pens, one with the copper tip and one with the plastic tip. The plastic tip is good for the Aurora Borealis. And the special drills, you get two purple squishies to go with it, two purple waxes, you get a, an extra four placer, a thick walled four placer, and a seven, uh, seven place straightener, which I love. You get these little gates and they are to go on your tray so that you can divide it up into a couple colors if you want to do that. And you get a nice bag of baggies to help you kit up as you need it. Nice, beautiful kit. Nice kit. Alrighty. Now, <clears throat> let's untie the beautiful purple bow. You can immediately feel it's a short lint, soft canvas. You can see that the edges are pinked and poked, as I like to call them, to prevent fraying. And I'm going to roll this up from the other edge and let the goodies drop out so that we can also relax the canvas so that it falls straight. 60 by 60 is a really good size. It's not too big and it's not too small either. Nice good chunk to work on. <clears throat> okay, so here is this beauty. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It is just gorgeous. Look at this. Look at the colors. Oh, vivid, vivid spring colors. 
So you get a, a sticker, uh, a sticker for the inside, a separate Dreamer Design sticker, and a separate I Love Diamond Painting type stickers at the bottom. You also get an inventory sticker so that you can tell everything about the canvas, put it in your inventory book where your, um, your finished pieces go, and you get the individually cut labels with the sequence number, the symbol, and the DMC color code on the other side. So that's perfect. Very perfect. You can use those for kitting up. Also, you get the, I think I have a newer instruction booklet that I'm used to. It's a nice thick little instruction booklet. It says Paint with Passion. And you get all kinds of things in here. Uh, thank you for your purchase. You get to scan me for 15% off of your next kit, which is excellent. And you get an introduction to their social media where you can post your masterpiece when you're finished. The kit has a thumbnail at the top with all the, the information that you need up here. It has a uh, symbol chart on either side, a warranty. Uh, on the canvas and the drills, and it has a social media information at the other corner. So let's get into these drills and see. This has 63 colors, and let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight Aurora Borealis colors. Won't that be fun? Let's see, let's take a peek at these. I'm gonna bring it in so you can see them up close and personal. Okay. I like the way Dreamer Design puts them all in a <laughs> in one strip, all the Aurora Borealis in one strip. So that way when we take them out, uh, we know exactly where they are. All right, here are the gorgeous shades. Let me see if I can get them right side up for you. Okay. We have some of the greens. Orange and purple here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We have some peach. A little tiny bit of black. This, that's all the three tens you get in the entire kit. Is that? Okay. Burgundies and purples and yellows and oranges. Oh my gosh. Look at the purples. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Oops. Here's the rest of the ABs. I knew there was some more. There it is. Here are some more of the colors. We have some brilliant, brilliant shades coming through here. Oh my gosh. Look at those shades. Let's see if I can get another one in here. Ooh. Oh wow. And the oranges are coming in here. Offset the all the orange coming in here, pinks and greens and blues. Okay, that's it for those colors. But now I want to show you the Aurora Borealis. That's special drills. <laughs> all right, we have bright pink. Baby pink, we have the white, we have the mustard color, the green, the other pinks, the dusty rose pinks, and a purple and a blue. And they are at the bottom of the number list here. Let me wing you out a bit. So you can see in the canvas where they're going to go. There we go. Let's see. Let's go from... Which end here? All right, 963, this bright pink is the number two. Let's find, okay. They're in the rows here. They're in this one here. They're in the tulips in the background. It looks like, 
Okay, there are these. I see twos in here. I see twos in the background over here, and in this one, and over here, and up in here, and over here. So the twos are sprinkled everywhere, these bright pink ones. How about the green ones now? They're the letter Y. I see those in the stems, in the, the bright green of the stems. So they're in here, they're up here, around the edge here, all the way over here, they're up here, a little bit in the inside of the flower there. So you have that scattered around as well, in that bright green color. How about the dusty roses? These two, that's the, those two symbols. The lighter of the two pinks, I see in the middle of here, some in here. I see both colors, both shades in this one, both shades in that one. The darker shade in here. I see, let's see, oh, both shades in here, both in the darker shades in here, both of them here and in here. Let me see. Oh, both of the shades in here. It's in the darker, pinker areas. Uh, yeah. So it's in these fluffy flowers, but it's in the darker shades of those fluffy flowers. They're like dahlias, I believe, which would be a summer flower at least out here in the East Coast. All right, so now we have the, the dusky blue. I see that in the background here. And in these little, the darker blue flowers in here, in the daffodils. Um, up in here, there's some at the very top, there's some in between here, there's some over here and down in here little bits down in there. The lavender is the letter A. I see those along the edges out here, all along this corner, in this corner, and in that corner. Lots of them in this corner. What about, okay, they're sprinkled in the middle here. Letter A, letter A. There are little bits of them in here. So they're basic, and some in here, they're framing it. They're pretty much framing the outside uh, U-shape, the outside edge. We have a lot of white. I'll show that last. The, the orange is the letter B, and they are in this bright yellow flowers in the, the uh, tulips. And there, and there, and no, not up here, but over here. And in this one, in this one, in this one. In here and in here, over here and in this big one. And the number ones, the whites are number ones, the white shiny, there's a lot of those. They are in here as well, they're in the daffodils, they're in these flowers, they're in the middle, they're over here, they're in the edges, they're in these ones, they're in those, these daffodils. They edge this, they're in the corner here, they're edging this flower, they're in bits and pieces here, they're up in here. The whites are all over. The whites sprinkle the entire canvas, I believe. Um, and they kind of draw things together. So you have the greens that kind of like pull up through. You have the whites that are sprinkled everywhere. You have the different other shades sprinkled in different patches here and there, which is a really nice mix, a nice mix of colors. You could even, if you wanted to add some sparklers to it, you could add them in the center of some of the flowers. You can do that. There's not too many um, vivid centers that you can use that though. Um, so that would be the only thing that maybe I might add, but this will be beautiful just the way it is with all the sparkle. I really love um, Dreamer Design, the sparkle in there, the cut of their drills. You see it there, um, resin or acrylic drills. Let's see. I don't see the 
the telltale divot in the back of the drills, of acrylic drills. These could be resin drills as well. They're definitely a five cut, um, 5D, which is the extra sparkly cuts. There's 15 uh, cuts across the top which reflect the light in lots of different ways. They're definitely 5D. I'm not sure if they're resin or acrylic drills. They kind of seem like resin drills to me. I don't see the telltale divot in the back otherwise. But um, I'll know more as I get to work with them more one-on-one. -on -one. There is a little bit of trash I see but not much, not much. <clears throat> I wouldn't worry about working with Dreamer Design squares. They, they're beautiful, they work beautifully. I haven't had any problems with Dreamer Design squares, at least not in the recent years. Um, and I've been doing this for quite a number of years now. In the beginning, I, everybody, we had troubles with everybody's square drills. But um, don't, don't let them scare you. Uh, this is a little bit of confetti, pretty much confetti canvas, which means that there are a lot of colors in a small area that you have to change colors often. But this is going to be so brilliant and so beautiful. I have one this big that is other flowers from them. And, and having this side by side with that is going to be absolutely gorgeous. Very, very beautiful. Well, dreamers, I hope that you are able to find something that you liked in this canvas. It's called Spring Is Here by Alyssa Carey, and it's a 60 square uh, centimeter with, oh, does it see seven Aurora Borealis drills? It's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Oh, I love canvases like this. Oh, oh my goodness, I just love them. Please like and subscribe so that others who like diamond painting, who like vivid colors, who like crafting of all types can find the work basket here and join our work basket community on Tuesday nights when we get together for Tea and Talk Tuesday at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We can enjoy each other's company and have a little fun together. Okay, divas, I will see you there soon. Bye.